Question number six says that Lipika reads a book for one three fourth hours every day. She reads the entire book in six days. How many hours in all were required by her to read the book? So to start with, we'll first write the number of hours Lipika read the book per day. And from the question, we can see that that is one three o four hours every day. So converting this into an improper fraction. We write it as 4 times 1, 4 plus 3, which is 7. So 7 over 4 hours per day. Now we have to see that how many days does she read this book? So she has read the book for 6 days. Every day is spending 7 over 4 hours. So we write the number of days to be equal to 6 days. Now from this, we can find the total number of hours required by her to read the book. And that will be equal to the number of days she has read the book times the time spent by her every day on reading the book, which is 7 over 4. So we'll try and cancel out the common factors. 2 2s are 4, 2 3s are 6. We multiply and get the product as 21 over 2, which is an improper fraction. So dividing 21. By 2, we get the quotient as 10, remainder as 1. So 10, 1 over 2 hours is the total time or the total number of hours that she required to read the entire book. And this is how we solve this question. To learn more about how QMath can help you crack school and board exams, explore QMath Leap a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers.